My name's Michelle. I was working in a small pub. A couple of truck drivers arrived in one afternoon. I was working behind the bar and I looked at one of them and I thought, I'm going to marry that man. So we, I came here with him and we moved to Leeton and he didn't have a job. I had my family there, but and he worked very hard trying to find somewhere. Yeah. Since we moved back to Trundle, I've just been out in the shed and I've, all my photos, they're all over the place. I don't know where they are. They're in different boxes and things. And I've just found a couple of photos in a box that had Dad in them. That was... Marilyn got dressed across the road, a really good friend of Mum and Dad's, Betty's, Betty Coglin's. It was a very happy day. He was a, he was a good grandfather, a very good grandfather. So about, so it would have been about 25 years ago, I found out that Dad had been having a, an affair. Well, I don't know how long it lasted or whatever, but I don't really know all the details and I sort of didn't want to know. And that he had conceived another child with the woman he was having the affair with. Um, that was really quite, uh, I don't know how to explain what it was like finding out, but it just shattered everything that I thought about my father. And I became terribly angry and distant and hence cut him out of my life, I suppose, you could say. Recently, my dad passed away. He wrote me a letter, which I never opened, and I refused to open. But I kept it. I didn't want to throw it out. I kept it. I don't, I don't know why I kept it, because I was so angry and hurt with him. And anyway, Trevor suggested, hey, we're making a little time capsule. We're putting some coins in it from the time and a photo. And he suggested that I put the letter in the time capsule. And I have forgotten all about the fact that we'd done that. And anyway, we're back in Chundle. The mailbox is still actually out the front and it's still painted Jada Park, T Mar, TJ Mar. I got to thinking when we moved back, now that Dad's passed away, that maybe I should, if I can, find the time capsule, if I can remember. We, we buried it near a tree, and I've been thinking that maybe it's time, if I can find it, it's time to read the letter and maybe make peace with myself and make peace with Dad.